Meantime, United Kingdom Prime Minister Rishi Sunak has confirmed that the British military jet had intercepted and downed drones launched by Iran overnight in each assault on Israel. Now, Sunak urged restraint to prevent further escalation of the conflict, emphasizing the imperative for level-headedness. Meanwhile, the UK's Ministry of Defense said they have moved several Royal Air Force jets and air refueling tankers to the region to intercept any airborne attacks if required. Last night, Iran launched a barrage of missiles and attack drones across the Middle East towards Israel. This was a dangerous and unnecessary escalation, which I've condemned in the strongest terms. Thanks to an international coordinated effort, which the United Kingdom participated in, almost all of these missiles were intercepted, saving lives not just in Israel, but in neighboring countries like Jordan as well. The RAF sent additional planes to the region as part of our existing operations to counter Daesh in Iraq and Syria. I can confirm that our planes did shoot down a number of Iranian attack drones, and I want to pay tribute to the bravery and professionalism of our pilots flying into the face of danger to protect civilians. Well, as I said yesterday, it's clear that Iran is determined to sow discontent and destabilize the region, its own backyard. Uh, that's very clear from its actions. If this attack had been successful, the fallout for regional stability would be hard to overstate. And we stand by the security of Israel and the wider region, which is, of course, important for our security here at home, too. And what we now need is for calm heads to prevail. We'll be working with our allies to de-escalate the situation, and I look forward to speaking to G7 leaders later this afternoon. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.